Hey, 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 welcome back to my channel. And today we're gonna review Masterbooks. <laughs> All right, let's jump right into it. So, like in my last video, I talk about how we ended up switching over to uh, deciding to do homeschool and we were swamped and overwhelmed with all the things of uh, curriculums because it is crazy out here. So I started jumping on YouTube. I started jumping on Pinterest and blogs and all the things of homeschooling mamas of trying to find a curriculum that I could get all the subjects that were required by state for us as a homeschooling family, as well as um, it being having a God focus in it. And I was totally did not know about Charlotte Mason, did not know about unschooling, did not know about um, all the all the schooling, all the different things that have to do with homeschool. I didn't know any of that. All I know is I thought homeschool was, you know, you have curriculum at home and you basically take from school, but you bring it home. That's that was honestly my full understanding in the beginning. So when that happened, I decided um, to just read as much as possible. So with the further ado, we decided on master books and, um, I'm just going to show you what comes with the first grade, uh, bundle. And then I will share our thoughts and review of what we thought of our master book collection from this year. Okay. So the first one I have on just looking at me is my story. This is going to be your history book. It's my story and the world around me, book one. So that is your history. Then there's math. And this is the lessons for a living education, level one. Then you have your phonics, which is the foundations of phonics and easy learning or easy lessons for early learners. Then you have your science. This is your adventures in, uh, in creation. Let's talk science. And then I have these two little books that came that actually go with the language arts, which I have in a folder here um, because it comes as a loose leaf packet of paper with all of the language arts um, bundle for that. And it comes with these two books, not too small at all, which is the tale of, it's the mouse's uh, tale of Noah's Ark. And then the door of salvation, which is this cute little pop-up book that talks about the door on the Noah's Ark. Okay. So that's what comes with the entire collection. And my review on this is here are the great things that I love about it. It's affordable. You mamas out there, you daddies out there, they're like, we're gonna homeschool. I have no clue where to start, but I want it to be a really fun a curriculum. I want to be able to have the freedom and space to not have to stress out about scheduling, what I'm actually gonna teach for that day, but I get to just enjoy the process of teaching them. This is a great program for you. Master Books is awesome and no, I'm not sponsored. This is just a true review of a mama who was in a position who needed to get a curriculum for her daughter for first grade. Um, they do first all the way up to, I believe there's some high school programming or programs on there and curriculums. Um, and I think it's great. I It, it was easy to order, um, affordable. The bundle was as is and it covers all your basic uh, subjects and it um, quick and easy to ship um, they uh, they actually have a Facebook chat page where you can check out all the things about them and if they the founder actually will talk and do a review on a certain subject and then you even are able to get the community that way so that was awesome I found that shortly after I made the purchase and I love that it has a Charlotte Mason um, connection where the learning is not just happening through just doing the math. Like for, for instance, for this one, it's like it gives you creative meaning stories to go with the math. So um, this like one is about a brother and sister who are visiting their grandparents and how they learn how to count and do all the things in first grade math. Um, 
and the same in history. This one, it'll give you scripture, uh, background, you go on a quest, all the things. And so that are those are the top reasons I love it. It has a God focus. There's a Facebook group that allows you to be in connection. Um, it's affordable and it makes it simple for that mom or dad who needs there to be somewhat of a structure and give them what to do. This is very easy for a person that's going from being in public school and transitioning transitioning from ho to homeschool and just not wanting the stress of trying to figure everything out. Perfect. For me, and it gives you the, also the option to do it for the full 36 weeks for a school year, for a full year curriculum, or you can even cut it in half. You can do whatever you, you choose. It's, it's up to you, honestly. And that's the greatest thing I love about homeschooling is that there's such a freedom to just choosing what works best for you. Now, for us, will we be using Masterbooks next year? No, not really. Um, the only program or the only book that we will move forward in is their history. So this is the history one. We are going to do history two. My story too. Um, Zoe loves this. This is her favorite. She's really enjoyed being able to see the world and ask questions and learn. And we take it lesson by lesson. And sometimes we develop our own unit study all around wherever we're traveling to. So when we studied Russia, I found a Russia um, documentary and we sat and watched all about Russian um, animals and or animals that live in Russia. And so this, we really enjoyed it. And we're still, we're almost wrapping up the quest. Um, and we do this two times a week and we love it. So this is our history and we will continue with master books on this because I just love the stories. I love the information, the, sm the cool facts that I didn't even know. So I'm over here learning it. This I believe is so great for a kindergartner transitioning to first grade. For my daughter, she, was already exercising her first grade skills kind of prior to first grade. And so this was review for her and it was okay to review like the first three months, but by like Thanksgiving, she was burnt out and ready to not do this anymore because she was like, I know what each letter sounds like and no. <laughs> and I had to honor that. I had to honor that this was something that even though she, did it for the first three and a half months, four months, she was over it. And so we finished up as much as we could and, and we actually doubled up on some letters just so that we could really make sure that we understood what each letter meant. And then we stopped up after uh, December. And then for math, it was the same thing. Very much review and great for fundamentals. Like if your child is a little bit more, um, wants to take her or his time, this is a great program, great curriculum for you. And for my daughter, she's more of a, on a bridge system. By the second half of the school year, she was doing um, first and second grade math. So she's teetering right now. Um, and she's wrapping up first grade math the where you can see where she's starting to do the next level. Amazing. I truly enjoyed it as my introduction to homeschooling and an introduction to Mace, Charlotte Mason lifestyle or um, a curriculum style. Truly enjoyed that. Um, but overall for me as a bundle, it ended up not being as fruitful to be able to use for the full 36 weeks because my daughter was just a little bit more advanced. So this is a great review. I'm actually going to keep these for when it's time to start introducing these things to Josephine. But overall, I would say it's, it's, a, it's, it's a hit or miss. Um, it depends on what you're looking for. And, and like I said, I can't push it enough. If you're looking for something that's affordable, you want to be able to homeschool, but you don't want to break your bank. You don't want to spend more than $200 on a curriculum. Master Books is your girlfriend right here. <laughs> I would totally do Master Books. Um, but if you're looking to expand and you want to be able to be a pull from other things and, and have other reading materials and resources, I would say that you could still do them and break them up to where you expand them for the week on whatever lesson you would want to do or you could just stick strictly to the book. If you're strict to the book system and you like to just keep it very militant, Masterbooks will do perfect for you. And yeah, 
So I hope this video was encouraging and educational and inspiring. Um, and yeah, I say give uh, this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And I can't wait to see you on your next on the next video. Please hit the subscribe button, share with your friends, and I'll see you next time.